was already won the game that's here for part 15 of this more Aussie playthrough. So in the previous video, uh, we just fought a boss of um, Seaside Kingdom, that squid man. <laughs> Squidward's ancestor. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that too. <laughs> he got he got pissed off at us because we stopped from drinking that fountain. But that fountain didn't belong to him, so that's his fault. <laughs> So, so in today's episode, um, we're gonna explore some more of uh, Seaside Kingdom by going down the depths. You now, when you talk about the tears of the kingdom depths, <laughs> or the depths of hell, yeah, that too. Uh, every time I hear depths, I think tears of the kingdom. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's not, okay. it's not like we need a cappy in, in, in this segment anyway. <laughs> I don't know, but yeah, we just down here to collect some more power shards, moon shards, dodging the uh, Super Mario 64 eel. Mm. They look so detailed in this one, but they look creepy as hell in, in 64. Yeah, when, it, yeah, like when it was in that sucking ship, I'm like, okay, what the hell is that? And I never told anyone, but I'm, when I first saw that eel, I mistaken with a blue bell because of the face. I thought a blue bill was stuck on the ship, but it was an eel. So I said, so I, uh, I pretty much swam up to the surface and swam back down. And I saw the motherfucker swimming around, like, okay, how the hell he got out? Because always. Oh, Jesus turned the. a tomato. We hurry up out of here. Don't fall over, I hold my breath. <laughs> you always thought that, that eel was so RNG to get out. <laughs> right. But yeah. Hmm, so relaxing. Got a little underwater relaxing music. Moon shards in the and, sea. And happy Halloween, everybody, on the day we're recording this. Yes. Oh, yeah. I really, I, had, I did Jack Show on Halloween, but played Spider Man 2, and I beat it. And 100%ed it. Gaming wise. I just need four more trophies for the Platinum Trophy. And while, uh, how I feel about Spider Man 2, I, I loved it so much. It's personally my game of the year. I know I said it with Tears of the Kingdom, but I did say it may change, and it did. <laughs> All right, but yeah, that's my game of the year so far. Oh, and this fucking thing coming up. <laughs> we, we're playing a little beach ball. Yes, another snail will say, uh, we, can you play volleyball for 15, like 15 times? Well, yes, but we're going to play it uh, 100 times. All right. Oh my god, yeah, yeah, playing with those two controllers at the same time is a bitch to do. Look at this. <laughs> See, I got I got control Cappy with the second player and use my and use my uh, one player controller to control Mario. But it is really hard to do. I'm not Sakurai. <laughs> oh shit. I don't know. See you. See me. <laughs> yeah, we gotta speed it up. Like I said, not only we gotta um hit the ball 15 ah. times, but we gotta hit 100 times. Of course. Yep. See, look, there's our problem on the upper left because we hit it 15 times. The ball. <laughs> <laughs> that sound. Yeah, as, as you can tell, it, it speeds up every time. Yeah, cause Cappy, that, this is why Cappy's your best friend doing the uh. The volleyball segment because Cappy moves a lot faster than Mario does. I love the music. Okay, it's not like you're having way too much fun with yourself. <laughs> yeah, I was having fun with that. <laughs> All right. I was, just the, I was just clapping along there, just thing. <laughs> See, yep, that was fast. Fireball uh, champ. Hero of the beach. Alright. Now we gotta search for some more power modes. Okay. Uh, real quick, what are you saying, sir? Oh, um, wait. Jump, I may be a bit behind. Oh, for that fault. Top it, too. Anyway. What the hell was that about? <laughs> oh, that was a uh, power book for force. <laughs> oh, okay. Denora spot on Tommy because he was fucking up, uh, um, uh, Maria, uh, Maria 
Garcia. <laughs> All, right. All right, you had the right time stamp. Uh, I didn't hear you. I, I was trying about the uh, uh, transition you had. Oh, we have 5, uh, 12, 5, 13, 5, 14. 520. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm I think I'm there or maybe just like a second behind, but either way it's fine. Hi. <laughs> it was just a few I was just a couple seconds behind. I was just trying to catch up. Yeah. I, I had fixed the quality because it was on 144 P. I'm gonna get you! Fuckers! <laughs> Good luck with that. <laughs> Go that chuggy, you're gonna need it. <laughs> <laughs> That's one of my favorite quotes over Charles Play too. I'm gonna get you, fuckers! <laughs> oh my god, who <laughs> the hell cares? <laughs> what, you only like Chucky Eber? Come on. No, that, 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 no, that was just as much what Chucky said. <laughs> That's just more to what Chucky was saying. <laughs> That's why Peter said, who the hell cares? <laughs> You're trapped in there, who cares? Oh, I See get the later. joke now. <laughs> <laughs> that's what I was doing. No, no, I, no, I, no. Chucky's fine. I don't mind Chucky, but just what he was saying, that's what I was saying more to respond to. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah. That's why, you know, get you fuckers. Oh, oh my gosh, who the hell cares? <laughs> You're trapped in there, shut your mouth, we're getting out of here. Have a nice day. <laughs> But yeah, after the first transition, uh, that was one of the funniest quote from Jannard because uh, he, yeah, he caught uh, Tommy uh, messing around with uh, Miguel's sister, um, Maria Garcia, and he called him a uh, a pussy chasing motherfucker. <laughs> oh, that's nasty. <laughs> oh well, can you blame Tommy? She was pretty hot. <laughs> <laughs> that troll song. <laughs> the most memorable <laughs> one is. <laughs> oh my God! That was hard back in the uh back in the 2010s. <laughs> Oh, that was so funny when I heard that the first time in my life. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> I heard that when I was at, at, a, at a game shop one day, and they, we were waiting for the tournament to start, and then I heard, this was like around like 2005, 2006. Oh, wow. I heard, first, I heard that for the first time. Not the original of it, but someone did it for uh, Lord of the Rings, for the Trolls song of that one. I liked. I was like, what the fuck is this shit? <laughs> it was so damn funny. <laughs> I couldn't stand it. <laughs> oh gosh, damn it! <laughs> what? Our own family guy, <laughs> Mr. Troll, Mr. Troll, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck's sake! <laughs> All right, so we don't want to see Sly King for now because um, we won't get the rest of the power moves till till later, till post scene. So we're gonna take out the black right. suits. Now we're going to our next kingdom. So hope you guys are hungry. Or or bought you some dinner or some luncheon. Cause that's pretty much our next kingdom. Woo! But like no. No. No, no, no. But don't no. get too 50. hungry. Gee, Christmas. Well 50, that's yeah, that's my problems I had in oh I think. <laughs> oh, you watched the video. I had to see it. I couldn't help but laugh. <laughs> oh, okay. Before we go to lunch in Canaan, we all go back to New Donk City, get that Gary Pick Moon. Wait, oh, come on. You'll promise us lunch. <laughs> <laughs> you promised me dinner. The lunch was a lie. <laughs> <laughs> It was a lie. You're sitting somewhere else, you jerk. <laughs> <laughs> I want my money back. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Yes. Can you give me a timestamp, please? Oh, uh, what? 944, 945, 946, uh, oh. 947. I guess you two fucked up again, didn't it? I guess so. I'm, I'm good. When I was, when I was holding up that other video that I linked. 
uh, <laughs> the Odyssey video started buffering for some reason. Oh, uh, oh gotcha. you gotta love it. Are you uh, caught up now, or do you need to give you time soon? Okay. Also, how the hell did you find that? Why was that moon there on the street? Oh, oh because, as I said, the Gary pick moon. Oh, yeah, 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 okay. That's right, because I, 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 those, those Gary pick was always confused me. Yeah, I know. Because on that Gary pick, it was a, it was a word, it had the word keep on it, and, um, and the problem was sitting above the, uh, first E, Oh, uh, okay, okay. And you had to ground pound that particular spot where you saw the moon out on the, on the picture, on, above that E, the first E. Yeah, because those, that, those freaking really confused me. I could, I could never figure out what the heck I was supposed to do with that. It, and the thing is that um, when you when you stay when you stay above the problem, you, you're not gonna feel your control vibrate. All right, right. And you gotta be like pistol perfect at it. Lunch time. Lunch time. Get your lunch. I like. Fish sticks. <laughs> Get your fish sticks here. Gotta have a number seven, two number large, an extra large with extra dip, a million fries, and a Large soda. Where a where a big smoke said. <laughs> so say where was that from? Oh, Grand Theft Auto uh, uh, San Andreas. Oh yeah yeah yeah. Okay, I remember you. I think you mentioned that once. Yup. Yeah. The, the roll. After some cooking. After some cooking. They cooking some trouble. That's what they're doing. <laughs> yeah. What's up, Doc? Or, uh, what's cooking, Doc? Oh yeah, you remember the uh the chocolate lava of Super Mario World? Now get a little of uh, strawberry uh, lava. Ah, uh, yep, yeah, that's basically your lava. You don't want to touch that stuff. That's me, hot as hell. Yeah. This is a fun kingdom. We we got freaking uh, corns and stuff. There's corn to the platform. <laughs> and you got Goombas just... wearing their chef hats. Your chef? <laughs> yeah. Uh, where's, the lamb, where's the lamb sauce? <laughs> Yeah, Where's I, the lamb sauce? I'm asking Oh, you. and we got tomatoes, the loud tomatoes, which melts when you hit them with your cap. Huh? Oh. Yeah, well, at least we took on a lunch date. <laughs> How they erotic. Turquoise, uh, moon. Love above the lava. <laughs> More like a lunch date, but yeah. And she came back. He's like, oh, yeah, Mario, you're not my type. <laughs> right, the, right, the corn. But hey, uh, Gabella lady, uh, freaking uh, Bowser is in love with, with an elephant. Oh. And her name oh, is Peach. The, it's, a, it's the attack of the killer tomatoes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you can use some as lavas when you uh kill with the uh with the uh the pedal bow, pedal boo. Fireballs, yup. <laughs> Yup, one of my favorite quotes from Mario World cartoon. Eh, be a sucker do it better. <laughs> it was okay on my end, but be a sucker do it better. Fireballs, yup. Yeah, cause he, he, he has a love of fireballs in the cartoon. <laughs> See, every time I look at this, uh, this kingdom, it reminds me of culinary arts. Cause I, I took culinary arts back in, um, back in my, uh, in trade school. Uh, I think it took like a, uh, I forgot what the name of the class was. It involved cooking and, uh, of course, um, uh, home ec. Huh. Uh, home ec, that's it. I'll tell you right now, taking Connie Arts, that, yeah, that job is freaking hard. You know what was hard? I had to learn how to use a sewing machine back in fifth grade. Soul machine. Oh, by putting the freaking uh, money in the joint and, and press the button, a specific button to, to let go your. to pick up Pepsi Soul, for example, that one? Uh, no, no, literally like a soul machine, like, you know, sewing clothes. Do you think he was saying, talking about a vending machine? Yeah, it's not you said soul machine. Uh, no, oh, I, okay, I see what you mean. No, sewing, like an S. Oh my god! <laughs> it sounded like you said soul machine. Now you got I, me I doing gonna, it. <laughs> I was gonna argue about it, but I can see why it's kind of close to soda. It's so weak. <laughs> so we Oh, okay. Ah, sh ah, shut up over there, you. Oh, oh. So why would we have to learn how to use a soda machine in 
in the fifth grade. <laughs> <laughs> we have to be, uh, I think there probably have to be in a, like, a mechanic class or something for that to learn, something, for, do something like that. Yeah. That'd be really hard for a fifth grade to have to learn. That's, uh, that's stupid. Yeah. Uh, well, I argue on no. the sewing part, yes, it, that, that's hard, too. Yeah, See? I literally had to learn how to sew, like, um... I think it was like a... It was something for Christmas made it do. It was like a little... I guess like a little... Fuck, I think it was like a little napkin. Some kind of qualified napkin to make, or a little sewing shirt. Yeah. I don't know. It, it was a real pain in the ass to do. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. In effect, you gotta, and, you gotta try your best not to, not to stab yourself with that pen. Ugh. Hey, Jesse for Team Rocket. <laughs> I know it's on, I'm just kidding. <laughs> The brothers are at some cook. Yeah, I was just gonna get the reference, but okay. The only part I enjoyed about that guy is actually actually cooking stuff. Well, we got to do well in ninth grade. At least I enjoyed that more because uh, she gave us a day in class where we can actually uh, cook whatever we want that day. Mm hmm. So I decided to bring in a uh, crab meat and um some cheese and pizza for us to make a, a crab meat pizza. Huh. I see. My favorite, my favorite food lately, though. I did. It's always so good. <laughs> I, I don't got any favorite foods anymore. <laughs> I mean, I got it, it, I mean, it, it used to be spaghetti. Oh man, spaghetti! That, 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 that food was the shit back in the day. Not gonna lie, I'm not really a big fan of spaghetti. <laughs> oh, Mario going to the proof. Like the... <laughs> oh, I'll tell you. <laughs> well, not not the thin spaghetti. I, I do have pasta noodles and all. I, yeah. I mean, I had like a I had like tortellini before, just with like yeah. a Alfredo cheese sauce instead of like tomato sauce. Yeah. That sounds pretty darn good. <laughs> yeah. But nowadays. See, I like pasta. Yeah, I like pasta also. Oh, lasagna. Oh, well, that's delicious. I'm, I may eat lasagna, like, on rare occasions. It tastes the same as spaghetti, in my personal opinion. Lasagna, um... You had, like, a chicken parmesan once. Huh. That was really good. Uh, uh, oddly enough, I actually made, made it for a sandwich one time. It was a little big to eat, though, but, uh... It was so worth having. Buy me a meatball sandwich. My brother loves that. Oh, yeah, those are so good. I haven't had a meatball sandwich in a long time. Oh my god. Well, no, actually, no, actually, I did it at home. But there were little meatballs, so we had, had, I had like a meatball sandwich, like, like Subway, though. Oh, no, those are good. Such those foot long ones. Whew. Meatballs, marinara sauce with some um, cheese on it. Ooh. Cooked and everything. Hmm, that's good. Dude, that's one hot strawberry. <laughs> I heard of hot ice cream, but, but, but what the hell? I'm sure they've they've made hot things with own strawberries. <laughs> Floating in sinking. I don't, I don't know exactly what it is, but I, I'm sure it's a thing. Maybe. <laughs> it's only thing we're talking about food on here anyway, since we are in a kingdom right now. Yup. So it only makes sense. Oh man, what is Fang from uh, Fair vs. Epwis in this kingdom? Oh my goodness, that this kingdom would have been destroyed. <laughs> What kingdom? Uh, this kingdom, the Legend Kingdom, if Fang was, was here. Oh shit. Yeah. Probably, yeah, then. Cause, the, yeah, I, he, he is showing science that he has an eating disorder. <laughs> Looking back at it. <laughs> Gosh. Yeah, cause Gosh. all he loves is food. Yeah. Ever, ever says food this, food that, food, 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 food. It's nice to have food, mm. nice to enjoy food, but... I mean, he okay. definitely loves keeping toast in his mouth. Hahaha! <laughs> <Those are> toast. <laughs> I was like, was that bowl of cereal over there, or is that just stew? I'm pretty sure it was stew. Oh, okay, it looks like cereal, I mean, because of, because of the white liquid. Oh like yeah, they could, they, that could take a Pablo mission, by the way. Because oh, we got... Oh yeah, that's definitely, that's definitely stew, okay. Let's play some more Mario Bros. 2! Pick up the specials off the ground and throw things. Yeah, but does a door appear when you uh, pick up a formula one out there? Unfortunately, not. 
<laughs> so yeah, we gotta cook that uh that ingredient. The cook the cook of a power moon. Go ahead and turn the Yup. Number one. Even the fortress show. <laughs> Rashes. Rapes, I guess. No, it looks like apples. Never mind. And a pumpkin. Pumpkins, yup. Orange pumpkin. Yeah, oh, how appropriate because Halloween today at the time of this coin session. Mm-hmm. I ain't getting no Halloween. Can... Halloween. Well, the only Halloween stuff I eat is the Oreo cookies. Uh, Halloween ho Oreo cookies. Right. Is this a great mm. too? Oh um, no, this is not a uh well, great. Well, those are the well, those are the bowl of stew, so <laughs> not <nice>, gonna be. <laughs> No, I got because the, the thing is, I read that in Patrick's voice. <laughs> is that an instrument? <laughs> no, that's not an instrument. Is mayonnaise an instrument? No, Patrick, mayonnaise is not an instrument. Orange <laughs> ranch is not an instrument either. <laughs> <laughs> I love how he called him right there on that before you had a chance to say it. <laughs> yeah, it's Patrick. What do you expect? Oh, uh, now I, lo I love, love that. <laughs> Now, now we're playing as uh, Chef Mario. So he went from being a referee, a doctor, and now a chef. Yes, chef. <laughs> <laughs> now, uh, and now Mario gets to meet Gordon Ramsay. Then to compete on Hell's Kitchen. <laughs> oh boy. Now you could. Now you may already expect that he became a hotel manager, but no, the towel was a lie. <laughs> He's no hotel manager. This is called a Hotel Mario because he he yeah. he, he goes. Bowser is making other ones that are running it. Yup. And Bowser be like, why can't they call it Hotel Bowser? Because we're not playing as you. <laughs> oh hey. Oh, I love doing that. That's a different show. <laughs> oh, I do it too. I've been Oh shit, hey plants, keep that away from Neptune. Hey plants, oh shit. I'm not a huge eggplant still. Yeah, I'm not a huge fan of eggplant anyway. <laughs> and, I, and, and oh my god, every time I see eggplant nowadays, they use it as a uh, you know. If you know, you know. I, moving on from that, <laughs> no, I don't want to talk about that. And the fucking peach! <laughs> what about Sipia's <laughs> soul? I wasn't about to say anything. <laughs> oh, I thought you were about to say something for a second. Okay. Yeah. I was gonna say, uh, I did try... My parents did try using, uh, uh, actually making, uh, fried eggplants once, and... It actually tasted pretty good when they're fried. Hmm. They're better all tasting, uh, fried than, uh, being raw. Yeah. Oh, wait, random so, question. Uh, you ever had liver and onions? No. Oh my god. That, my go. grandmother, grandmother <laughs> loves it, but it sounds disgusting. Yeah, it's from it, it's from Doug. Ugh, yeah. Mean. Yeah, Doug. He, oh, he, that's nasty. Oh yeah, he was tempted to try uh, the liver and onion so he can so he can press uh, Patty. He he didn't need to do that. It's not worth it. I mean, he ate it, but uh, but the problem is that it's it's unknown if he if he likes it or not. <laughs> Maybe he actually does. He just I may mean, not revealed it. Why don't those things go away? What the lava? The lava things? No, it's it's there for no, a the, reason. The... No, I meant the tomato sauce. I just saw there. Oh, oh might yeah, it they... might disappear by then. Yeah, I believe so. Still so haul around the platforms. Hey, I was gonna say that um that um at the end of the episode after Doug tried that uh liver and onions, it turns out that Pei was, was fucking him the whole time. She's like, ah, yeah. I should have known better. Extreme sim simmer. I was like, you didn't have to do that. There we go. Clear, clear to stay there. Yeah, they were having beats the whole time and then, and it, and it was implied that Doug don't even like beats. I'm like, here we go again. Oh yeah, because he was hypnotized into uh, not liking beeps at beats at one point. They're pretty, pretty, pretty earthy and all. And <laughs> I haven't tried myself, but I don't know how beats would taste. Yeah, me neither. Sound bad advertising. 
Yeah, I never tried liver and onions. Could I <laughs> but yes, it is a thing. Yeah, it is. Oh, I know it is. David said it don't taste all that great. <laughs> I might as well bring this up for Halloween since we're closing in. Uh, what's your guys' favorite candy? Uh, oh shoot. My well, my favorite Halloween candy is uh candy corn. Really? But my favorite candy in general has to be M&Ms. Okay, good. Yeah, I prefer the classic M chocolate M&Ms. are so good. Yeah. Um, how much you be yourself? So, you have a favorite? Uh, That's a tough not one. Sure, honestly. Yeah. Like I said, I feel the same yeah, way about I food. I like M&M's as well. I like my fair share M&M's as well. But I like yeah. the peanut M&M's. Yeah, oh, I like, okay. yeah, I like the plain ones. You know, they got a lot of options of M&M's lately. Like regular one, peanuts. There's peanut butter M&M's. And there's, a, there's even a fudge brownie M&M's I heard about. Yeah. And there's like a pretzel kind M&M's. I, I think I've seen like that. Called like a, there's a new one like called like birthday cake M&M's. I think I've seen that too. I was reading a... Spice m and <laughs> What kind? Pumpkin spice, since that seemed to be everywhere during around this time. <laughs> um, actually, let me check that right now. I'm kind of curious now. Now that you brought that up, because uh, I brought that up because apparently at our at my job, uh, they were doing like a candy face on to see which is the best candy. Well, I'm not gonna be able to find out who won it though, because they had the finals going on with M and M's versus Reese's peanut butter cups. Hmm. Oh, Reese's peanut butter. That's a good candy. Also, Reese's peanut butter puffs. Not the cereal, not, 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 not the cereal, but the candy. Yo, M and M's pumpkin spices, I think. Yeah. Oh wait, um. Fork, flicking D twelve. Well, here we go. Yeah, there are there is such things as pumpkin and M spice. Interesting. Interesting. Oh. Uh, Jake's. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Or flicking to the oh. summit. Oh. It's apparently a caramel cold brew M&M's. The fuck is that? Yeah, best way in the episode. <laughs> 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 All right, so next time some more Odyssey, we're, we're going to explore some more of uh, the Luncheon Kingdom. Better get your snack on. So till then, later, folks. Later. Later.